what is up everybody and welcome back to another episode of Ford Air. You got me, Solomon here, and uh, we're here at my shop and it's a pretty cool day. I've got three B100s here and I uh, just want to give you guys a little bit of a look at them. A lot of people haven't really seen these trucks. So this is a 1979 B100. This one was imported from Mexico and uh, it still has some of the Mexican plates on it. And these are really cool. So they were sent down to Mexico as from a short bed chassis, just the doors in front and forward, but there was no back wall or anything. And then this was built by a company called IGA. And this truck's got a 302 with a four speed in it. It's pretty cool. It's got three rows of seats. And it was always a civilian truck, which is really nice. I actually drove this truck from Kentucky down here to Miami. I drove it here today. This thing just runs and drives great. Here is my 1963 B100. This one is actually from Argentina. It's in really rough condition, but the story behind it is really cool for me. Um, it took me a long time to find it, or not find it, I found it a long time ago, and then it took me a long time to actually be able to get it, plus importing it and all that. So this one's a long-term project. I want to start it soon, but the truck is really rough. So uh, this is the reason why I actually have that red unibody. A lot of you guys were wondering why I'm going to take apart a really nice unibody. And it's because I have a really not nice B100 that needs the doors, the, all the parts. I mean, there's so much on here. I mean, don't even bother looking at the hood. This is just garbage. And, uh, yeah. Yep, so it's a lot of Bondo, but unfortunately under the Bondo is rust. So luckily this is actually in good condition. It doesn't really have too much rust and then the back doors are pretty smoked. Wow. It's funny, they're not even that rusty. They're just really bad paint. Might be making a video really soon of me stripping this whole thing. I'm kind of uh, thinking about taking the truck and getting it all sandblasted and then primered one solid color so I could see what I'm working with. Well, that's crazy. But yeah, so this one's really cool. It's actually my favorite truck I own and uh, it's my dream truck. So it's a very long term project. I don't really have a uh, need to finish it anytime soon because I really want to do it right and I want to do it the first time. So, unsure what's happening with that. And then here we have the newest B100 for me. It's actually the middle. So this one's a 1975. This one was also out of Mexico. It was actually imported by Michael, the same guy who imported the 79. And uh, my buddy Brian bought this truck a while back. He brought it, he lives over in Clearwater, it's about four hours from here, you guys uh, saw when we picked it up in the last video, and um, he got the truck, then he lifted it, it's got a five inch auto fab lift, they did uh, blocks in the rear I think, and it's a cool truck, it runs and drives, they put it on 37s with uh, 17 inch Mickeys. The front is uh, just a really nice five inch kit looks really cool and then it's also a 302 with a four speed inside it's really pink it's all white Brian had this made so the back seat's not all bolted in but I'm gonna obviously bolt it back in and then something I forgot to show you on the other one was they all say, you know, they're made in Mexico, but right there, I don't know if you could see it, but it says B100. And uh, same thing. And I always thought that was really cool. So. Yep, these are the three B100s that I have. And uh, I'm actually gonna be making an update video on that one because that one, one of my buddies wanted it a little bit more than me. So it's now, 
his and we're going to be building it along with uh, Poppy's garage here really soon and that's going to be getting a 2020 F250 complete 4x4 chassis so uh, there's going to be a lot more to come with that we'll see you guys in the next video if you guys enjoy this content please consider subscribing to the channel if you like this video please give us a thumbs up it really helps got any questions comments drop them down below if you want to get some cool merch we got hats like this shirts a lot of other stuff head over to fordera.com we will see you in the next one see ya